you know, go around and get all that nut build up in them and don't and, and don't get it out. I mean, I'm, I'm I'm not trying to be disrespectful. God know I'm not dissing him or nothing. I'm just being real. You think God approve of, of men going around trying to have sex with other men? That's that Roman Empire shit. If you look at the whole Roman Empire, they always had that man on man, girl on girl action. You know what I'm saying? And don't get me wrong. I believe in God. I believe in God totally. I believe in Jesus. But the thing is, for me to sit here and say that I'm a, 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 a pure Christian, I can't say that. Not that I'm a five percent or not like that either. It's just that I know what I know who God is and I know what God do for me. But for me to say that I'm a Christian, I am a follower, I am a believer of Christ. You know what I'm saying? I do believe in God. But that's not always what make you a Christian. You know what I'm saying? Because the Roman Empire of what they got, what they believe that God's supposed to be about. It's all wrong, man. It's all wrong. Christianity was some shit that was made up after Jesus died. So yeah, I'm a follower of Christ, but for me to sit here and say I'm a full-fledged Christian, I can't say that. Know what I mean? But I, I ain't gonna go too deep into it, because it's a lot of stuff that I believe. And, you know, can't nobody change my mind on that, you know? I don't care what priest or who you sending me, I'm always gonna have my own belief and my own thought. And if I'm wrong, I want God to show me some kind of way from him himself. Not, I'm not disrespecting God. No kind of way. So don't take it like that. I want God to show me through his angels or through my dreams or something like that. That I'm wrong about the things I think about. Because for real, for real. Even though it's not in there like that. When you read uh, Adam and Eve. And you see how he talk about you bite the fruit. Bite for the fruit. That, the fruit of the tree that give you. Uh, that let you know a good and evil. Man, I could be wrong, but I feel like that's just like, I think the devil really went to Eve and had sex with her. That's just what I believe. I could be wrong, but that's what I believe. I believe that the devil tricked Eve some kind of way and was like, look, you know what I'm saying? God don't want you to know everything because if you know certain things, it'll open your eyes up. I believe that the devil had sex with Eve. And she got pregnant. The first time she got pregnant, she had Cain. You know what I'm saying? And then, he's like, the same stuff I showed you. You show uh, Adam or whatever. And then when Adam banged her or whatever. And then, like, later on, he got banging us, you know, some more or whatever. Because that's his wife or whatever. They had Abel. Because I'm trying to figure out. Why the hell was Cain so goddamn mean and, and Abel was so damn nice? You know what I'm saying? Where where all that anger and animosity just come from? Had to be built up from it from some. Jesus even Jesus even said yourself that you could tell a tree by the fruit that it bears. And when he was saying that, he wasn't talking about a tree. He was talking about humans, people. Just like if my dad is a totally evil person, and he, you know he had kids, then we're gonna even be corrupt and fucked up some kind of way too. That's all that was really saying. See, people got a lot of things. Like, you know, they concept of the Bible all messed up. I'm not saying that what I'm saying is 100%. But if I'm wrong or if my wrong in my belief or something like that, somebody please, that's a that's a strong believer in God or something, show me where I'm wrong at. I'm sorry for burping, but show me where I'm wrong at. Show me where I'm wrong at and help me. You know what I'm saying? I'm not saying I'm perfect. I do things that ain't right. You know what I'm saying? I have sex. I ain't married. You know? Show me, you know... What I'm messing up at. Show me, you know, show me um the things that I believe. Show me that they wrong. You know? That's why I'd rather for God, for God to do it. Because I know can't no human people really do it. That's just my opinion on that, man. And I know y'all gonna think I'm crazy. And I said, man, this dude is, is, is off the chain. But it's just something to think about, man. A lot, a lot of the things in the Bible just don't add up to me. Just like... When Cain got banished, right? And he went to where God, after he hit Cain, when he hit Abel in the head, and God sent him away. God was like, you're going to wander from the rest of, you know, from, your, from place to place to the rest of your life, right? 
He said, why you gonna see me out there in the wilderness? You gonna see me out there, somebody's gonna kill me. And God said, ain't nobody gonna kill you. Because if anybody kill you, I will curse them ten times worse than I cursed you. So, that let me know right there, Adam and Eve couldn't have been the only people that was really on earth. They were just the only people that probably God, like, made himself out of his own image. And then, it was some missing book. I can't remember. If somebody know where this book is at, please help me find it. But it was a book I read. It was a Bible. It was some kind of version of the Bible that I read one time. I can't remember. I, I was so little when I read it. But it was another woman that God sent down the first to, be, uh, to have Adam. But she didn't want him or something. And she was an angel or something too. But I think she didn't want him or something. Because she said she was beneath him. I don't know what book. Maybe somebody gave me a satanic book. So I don't know. But I read something like that before. And the other thing I read in it too. Was that. God told his angels one time. That look. This is Adam. This is one of my perfect creations. I won't try to bow in from. You know. Kneel before him. Because that's my creation. And a lot of angels did it. But I heard Lucifer was sitting there to himself like, huh, I'm not going to bow down to this peasant. You know, I'm better than him. It's something that you made, you know. And that's when the devil started turning against God. You know what I'm saying? That's from what I read. I could be wrong. I don't know what kind of book I read when I was young, but I read a book like this. I, I'm so, I, I, I mean, I'm older now. I don't know if it was fiction or what, but I read a book like that. And if somebody can point me in the right direction of where that book is at, now that I'm older and I'm wiser, um, show me, somebody like, let me know, if somebody know who that, where that book is at, man, hit me up on the inbox on my YouTube page, or send me an email at, you know, my same thing that I got as a new piss, a new piss at live.com, send me the answer, man, to that, or, or make a video about it, I mean, hey, look, you can reply to it and just tell me you replied to it, you know, and I approve it. I'm not one of those hating people to be like, oh, no, you can't make a video this to me. Nah, if I'm wrong or you feel like something where I'm at is wrong, show me where I'm wrong at. I don't care who it is, man. You know, show me where I'm wrong at and help me. You know, I'm kind of lost, man, with certain things I believe in. So uh, help me break this balance that I got with my soul, you know. But look, man, like I say, man, all my videos at the end, first of all, I'm going to say shout out to God, man. You know what I'm saying? For inspiring me to even think about doing this. It's not the devil that's, made, that's, that's inspiring me to do this. It's God that's inspiring me to do this. But if I'm wrong, you know, show me the error of my ways. Um, Shout out to all people that I hang with on Xbox. You know, uh, shout out to my homegirl, Patrice. On, you know, Patrice on, um, on YouTube or whatever. Just shout out, you know, just shout out to everybody, man. Um, shout out to Negro Saki, you know what I'm saying? Uh, Wolf. Who else? Um, uh, definitely Liquid Smooth. Um, a lot of people, man. Shout out to everybody. Shout out to everybody watching my videos. Shout out to my homegirl, Insane Cricket. My homeboy, uh, Chester Molester. You know what I'm saying? Um, Man, shout out to everybody, man. Just shout out to everybody, man. You know, shout out to all the people that I work with at both of my jobs. I'm not going to say what jobs they are because that's none of your goddamn business because y'all ain't going to be trying to get me fired for shit I say on these damn videos. But anyway, you know, y'all niggas know who y'all are. But uh, anyway, shout out, man, you know, and God bless, man. Take care.